our first day in Colorado. So with my sister Hannah. She's gonna take us around to some really cool stuff, like uh, the, the cliff, cliff dwellings. Stop <laughs> number one, the Manitou cliff dwellings. And then uh, Garden of the Gods. Oh yeah. Stop number two for the day, Garden of the Gods. So it's gonna be a fun day. Okay, that's it. <laughs> International Airport, domestic terminal, uh, flying to Denver. We're almost in Denver. It's like midnight our time, a little later. And it's like snowing out the window. For those customers visiting Denver, we wish you a pleasant stay. For those who live in this area, welcome home. We made it! <laughs> Sleepy head! We got a car! So, they definitely upgraded the car we were supposed to get. It looks like a pickup from the front. Look at the Colorado license plate! <laughs> So we finally made it to my sister's house in Colorado Springs. <laughs> it took like two hours to get here because we got stuck behind snow plows on the highway. And after like 12 hours of traveling, we were saying goodnight. Oh, okay, uh, come on. Let's go, I wanna sleep. Say hello, Hannah. Hey. Hello. Hi. Hi. Okay. Say hi, Heather. Hi. 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 And hello from me as well. We're gonna go and have a bunch of fun. Oh, that's, that's Pulpit's Rock up on the left there. Oh, okay. Oh, you see, I think there's a person on top of it right now. What? Yeah, I, I think there's a oh. person. Oh. So Hannah, can you explain NORAD again to the viewers? <laughs> What's NORAD? Well, supposedly it's over there on the top of that hill where all those towers are. And uh, it's just like, when, when everything gets really crazy, Four family, four room home. Oh yeah, so these pegs are for hanging meat and vegetables. And then yeah, the others are steps. Wow. Oh Sarah, lead the way. Woo. <laughs> you can probably go ahead through the other way. This is a storage bin. What are your thoughts there, May? It's really cool. This is the Kiva. The what? The sacred Kiva for ceremonies. A Kiva. Wally. Possibly symbols of rain. This looks actually like how like 
flat yeah. wall with like window opening. Can we technically like climb through these? Yeah, I mean, yeah. I saw people going through it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I guess if you're small enough. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go in. Whoa, yeah, just a little room. Really cool, echoey. Climb through. Okay. Oh man, it gets really dark. Look at the view out your window. <laughs> like mountains. And a Hannah. <laughs> it's a magic trick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm gonna go down. Oh. All right, I'm coming down to meet you. Okay. Space. I mean, this is amazing. Look at all the rocks and the scenery. I love how it kind of curves in and you can see the rest of the cliff dwelling. So it's really cool. They have these signs next to different plants and it talks about how the people who lived here 800 years ago used to use the plants in the area. So we are at the Cliff Dwellings Museum. It's like built into the side of the rock. Yeah. And you can go inside. Look. That is so cool. Some had flat back skulls because of the cradle boards. Because they were laying on the hard board, it struck for several months. And when the skull was soft and forming, it would result in the skull to form with a flat back. Wow. It's kind of sad almost. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't really affect them much. Okay, so we are leaving the cliff dwellings and heading to stop number two. Garden of the Gods. Garden of the Gods. Let's go. You have reached your destination on your right. This is really cool. Look, I didn't realize we were going to be driving like up into it. You guys excited? Yes. Yeah. I would say I'm going to be nearly like seven. No, I'm just kidding. Uh -huh. <laughs> we are at Garden of the Gods, stop number two. Yeah. It's crazy how like this one is like reddish brownish orange and this one's like a white. different color, yeah. Oh look, these are some of the wildlife we might see. Did we sight some wildlife? Wow, its ears are huge. How could it get any better? Look, look how narrow it gets. Like from this side, it looks like a big flat wall. Then you come over, and it's like so narrow. Looks like it could just like break off and fall over any time.
it's just flat with like trees growing and then just like stones sticking out there and then just like a bunch of like stones over there. Wow, this is beautiful. That's so cool. There you are. Sarah, what do you think? Okay, I'm coming. Wow. So Sarah, what do you think so far? It's really cool. I've never seen anything like it. Just the contrast of the orange rock against the blue sky. And then it's just so flat. And then it's these sharp, like thin rocks just rising into the air out of nowhere. It's, it's really like cool. like nothing I've seen before. Oh wow, this is beautiful. Wow. Right? Like the the spikes are cool, but then you see this big wall here. Just out of nowhere. And then you got the mountains up that way. Yeah. Got it. Wow, this is amazing. Wouldn't you say so, Matthew? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Matthew confirms. Wow. Look at this. Careful. Wow. Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> so we're at the top of one of the hikes in uh, Garden of the Gods. And it's just unbelievable. So we're walking back to the car from our God of the Gods walk. This is basically back the way that we came. We are back to the car. And we're gonna go get something to eat. Yes, I can't wait. Here's our car. And let's say bye to uh, this place. It's Garden of the Gods. That's what it is. <laughs> Thanks. And then. One of those will be a good transition. Let's go so we can eat. <laughs> the best. Nice. <laughs> so, we are at the top of one of the hikes. Um, and, um, Sarah, what's this place called? Garden of the Gods. Yeah, yeah. By the woman until the saliva changed the starch to sugar. Yeah. When this chewed Ooh. meal is mixed with the rest of the cornmeal and baked, the sweet cornbread results. So they would chew it to make it sweet. Gross. What else? 